the role of Marion is to, well, actually, I'll let him explain. Romero? Good afternoon. My name is Ramiro Najarro Cartio, and my role today is to introduce the word of the day, and I would be checking as grammaria, checking the feelings like am, a, uh, and so on and so forth. So the word of today, the word of the day is sensible. I chose this word because it has a, a very deep meaning to me and someday I want to become a sensible person. <laughs> I, want to, I want to encourage you to use this word. So let's move on. Toastmaster. was the best day of my life. My mother was a kind person, but at that moment she was probably overtired and maybe depressed. And she said to me in a bitter tone of voice, Mary Alice, this is the first day of your life that you haven't cried. <laughs> now, 80 years later, what do I remember of the joys of that wonderful day? Not a thing, <laughs> except that disheartening criticism at the end, plus the fact that later that evening I did cry, thus <laughs> maintaining my unbroken record. <laughs> Daniel Kahneman, Daniel Kahneman talks about memory and experience as two totally different things. Experience is what you have in the present, and the present moment is about three seconds long. There may be 60 million of these in a lifetime. How many do you remember? Very few. Memory is the stories we tell ourselves about our experiences. And defines a story, a plot, the significant moments, and the ending, especially the ending. All's well that ends well is a psychological deep truth. I recommend Daniel Kahneman's TED Talk on the experiencing self versus the remembering self. Mary Alice told me that a favorite memory of hers is the first time she saw the ocean. 
Everyone loves the ocean, right? Mm -hmm. The first time she saw the ocean, when she was 11 years old, her little brother and her rode the big waves in the inner tubes. And it was so exciting and she had so much fun. So now it's time for our first speech. Jane Trider, <coughs> her, the title, or um, she told me that her favorite memory was from her annual summer vacation. We, she said that we rented a house and the entire extended family would come. Now the children have grown up and they all have children and the parents have now passed away. But they still, the children and everyone still has the memories of when they were younger. And so that's very special to her. And I'm good. Yes, Rob. Rob is going to introduce um, and tell us.